How do we find rogue planets? Finding rogue planets is one of the hardest challenges in astronomy because they don't have a star to light them up. They're essentially invisible in the vast darkness of space. So how do we find them? One of the most effective methods is called gravitational microlensing. It's pretty similar to gravitational lensing. Here's how it works. According to Einstein's theory of general relativity, massive objects like planets bend the fabric of space-time. When a rogue planet passes directly in front of a distant star from our perspective, its gravity acts like a lens, magnifying and distorting the light of that star. Astronomers use this brief brightening of the star, captured as a spike on a light curve, to infer the presence of a rogue planet. The duration of the spike can tell us the planet's mass. For instance, a low-mass planet might cause a lensing event that lasts a few hours, while a more massive object could create an event that lasts days. Now, this doesn't happen often. Microlensing events are rare and they require precise alignment between the rogue planet, distant star, and the Earth. That's why telescopes like the Verisi Rubin Observatory are designed to monitor huge portions of the sky, increasing the chances of catching these fleeting events. Don't forget to like and subscribe, it's free, and you can change your mind at any point in time, and it really helps me how as well.